Originally, when we started testing out the effects of fasting, we were looking at uh, cancer risk markers, and we were hoping to tease apart the effects of fasting versus weight loss. Because when an animal loses weight, um, a lot of those effects are really just because of the weight loss and not because of fasting. Um, but what we found was that no matter what we did or how we kind of manipulated the fasting regimens, the mice consistently lost weight, even though we were trying to make them not lose weight. Um, so we realized basically intermittent fasting, one of the main benefits of it is, is weight loss. Uh, it also produces a lot of health effects like reduction in cancer risk markers, heart disease risk markers, as well as diabetes. But I'd say one of the major benefits is really weight loss. So I've been studying intermittent fasting for about 10 years or so, and I've run about five to 600 people through various fasting interventions. And we found that, I guess the main thing, similar to what we saw in mice, was that people lose a lot of weight with this diet. They also maintain muscle mass, which is great, because if you keep your muscle mass up, then you also keep your metabolism revved up, which is um, amazing for weight maintenance. Uh, we've also seen um, changes, really great changes in heart disease risk uh, markers, so decreases in cholesterol levels, uh, blood pressure, uh, diabetes risk also goes down. So we see decreases in um, glucose and um, insulin as well. So a lot of great benefits. I think it works well because people can adhere to it pretty well. A lot of people get excited about this diet because um, it's really different than conventional ways of losing weight where, you know, with typical daily calorie restriction, people need to constantly record stuff in food diaries or in apps and they never really get a break from dieting. Whereas with intermittent fasting, there there's a fast day where obviously you need to fast, but then there, you always get to look forward to the next day where you can eat whatever you want and basically, you know, enjoy wine with your friends and that type of thing. So I think because of the adherence, since the adherence is so good, people lose a lot of weight. So before starting this diet, a lot of people are concerned about feeling hungry all the time. Um, and I do have to admit that the first week is a little difficult. I say the first three to five fast days, uh, people do feel hungry on those days. But um, our research has shown that after about a week or so, anywhere from about seven to 10 days, uh, hunger goes down and fullness actually goes up. So once your body, once you've given your body a bit of time to adjust, um, yeah, you basically don't feel hungry or that hungry on the fast days, which helps you kind of stick to the diet long term.